Breaking news, guys. Breaking news. Microsoft and Sony have come to an agreement. They signed a deal that Call of Duty will remain on PlayStation consoles for the next 10 years. This is really good news. Um, this is great for a lot of the PlayStation users out there because um, we were kind of in the dark. We didn't know what the future of Call of Duty was. Um, we thought with the whole acquisition of Activision by Microsoft that, you know, Microsoft would hoard these games um, and not really see the light of day on Sony consoles ever again. Um, but this is this is good news. Um Good news for a lot of players out there who only have one console, who only have a Series X or who only have a PS5. Um, this is good news because simply put, Call of Duty is such a massive game that's loved by millions of people. And for people to have to pick and choose, oh, I'm going to go out and get an Xbox simply because I just want to play Call of Duty is absolutely crazy to me to take an entire game away from a massive fan base is greedy it is extremely greedy so I'm glad that Microsoft and Sony have come and closed this deal and signed it in ink that this game will remain on PlayStation consoles for the next 10 years because what about these people who have Sony Sony consoles who have friends who have Xbox consoles. Maybe not everybody wants to mix consoles and everybody wants to just be, you know, there's a lot of people out there who just like PlayStation. There's a lot of people out there who just like Xbox. You know, I, I own both consoles, but, I, it, you know, if I only owned a PlayStation, I have friends who play on Xbox. Then, you know, you can still enjoy that cross play. Um this benefits everyone, man. This this is really good news because um, I couldn't imagine a world with just Call of Duty on Xbox only. Call of Duty is only getting bigger. All right. Warzone is becoming much more popular. And, you know, this may not only be good news for PlayStation consoles, but this is good for people who own an Xbox simply because day and date, every Call of Duty game that comes out it will be on Game Pass day one. Okay, so I say this is a win for both here. This is a win for Microsoft. This is a win for Sony because I think everyone is getting a slice of the cake here. Everyone is getting a slice of the cake. The fans are remaining happy. Um, and I think that's just the most important thing. And I, I, I hope that that's what these companies understand. It's it's about making the fan base happy. Um, but a lot of companies out here are money hungry and they want to, you know, they're they're doing things to to keep, you know, the cash flow ro rolling in. And I do believe that while, you know, they still own the Activision product, Microsoft, they're making more money by this game being on multiple platforms. That's just, that's a no brainer right there. Um, the more consoles this game is on, is gonna rake in the cash. So again, that's good for everybody. Sony gets its numbers when a lot of people are on PlayStation plan. Microsoft is getting its money when everybody's buying Call of Duty for both PlayStation and Xbox. This is great, man. This is great. I'm, I'm, I'm happy that I'm making this video because a lot of people were scared. I'm telling you, a lot of people just were in the dark and did not know what was going to happen. So this is phenomenal news, you know, but to keep things short, you know, this the, again, this this is great news. I'm so happy. I hope the community is happy. I hope gamers are happy and we need more news like this in the gaming community. We need more news to keep the gamers united and to keep us together because we we got to stick together man these companies they're 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 pulling us limb from limb okay trying to get us to go one or the other way and i don't like that i don't want to go sony way or i don't want to go xbox way i just want to be in between and i want to enjoy both because i'm a gamer and the fact that I get to choose now how I want to play my Call of Duty, whether I want to play it on a Microsoft console or a Sony console, that makes me happy. I've been getting a lot. Of, I've been getting into a lot of resurgence lately, and this is and and this makes me 
really excited to see what the future of Call of Duty is going to hold. Because yeah. I, I just know that it the next installment is going to be bigger, it's going to be better, and it's going to be better for everybody on a spectrum. Because we can all continue to play the game that we love on the consoles we love. You guys take care. I hope this has shed some light um, on this topic for you guys. And I'll see you guys next time. Peace.